Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Persona 5 Royal with Alexa Vichy Games. On the last episode, we hung out with a bunch of our confidants because we had already uh, finished the change of heart for Shido. I mean, we were waiting for it to actually happen, but you know, we, we stole his treasure. So we've just been hanging out with our confidants. We hung out with the twins, we hung out with Sojiro, uh, with Haru. Yeah, we had a good time. Today, we're hanging out with more of our confidants, as you do. So it looks like Shido is available. We are also not going to work on, at the Ravalasia. There's no point in us working there. Err... Uh, so we're probably going to end up hanging out with Shinya. Um, Har is not available, so we won't hang out with her. <laughs> yeah, we'll go and hang out with Shinya. Before we do that, though, let's have a look at the stuff in Leblon, because we can. Uh, there should be something on TV. Ooh! Featherman! Crossing space-time, the Phoenix Rangers unite their powers as one! Will they be able to return to their original worlds? Revive and fight Phoenix Rangers! Next episode, Return of the Phoenix Rangers. Okay, I didn't know that there were different worlds of Phoenix Rangers here, and that's kind of interesting. <laughs> okay, all right, let's start with the pompous customer. Hi, how you doing? Those wonderful Phantom Thieves proved to be true heroes again. Of course, I knew it all along. You're pro thieves now? Well, no, not really. They did manage to stop all the attacks on my blog, though. The internet is so distracted by their comeback, no one has been attacking me for praising myself. Ha! Huh. Their return to heroic form was truly smashing. It's inspired me to be more courageous, too. I shall watch what becomes of them while preparing to take dramatic action of my own in my career. Well, I'll be going now. Alrighty, that guy's having a good time. Hi, Sojuro. Yeah. That Shido guy always seemed like a cunning ass, but I never thought things would end up like this. Yeah, no, he's a bad person. He's not great. All right, well, let's head over to... Actually, I can use the text to get over to Akihabara. Let's read our text from Shibuya. You've really improved. You're a natural at this, Ahamiya-san. If it's okay with you, I'd like to teach you a bit more. I feel like I can be go close to Shinya thanks to the Tower Persona of Black Rider. I feel like my bond with Shinya will grow stronger soon. Nobody thinks you're alive. What do you want to do? Uh, let's check our bond with him. Alright! We're only rank three. But we have to hang out with him. Let's do it. Okay. Let's head over immediately. Teach me. Understood. Okay, stop by the arcade! Hey! How are the Phantom Thieves doing? I'm still rooting for them. I hope they don't get discouraged and quit. Oh, the war is still going on. It's probably because they think I'm weak. If only I was as strong as the Phantom Thieves. Hey kid, you may be small, but you played a great game. What? So being big is better? Hey, my bad. I didn't mean it like that. I just thought we should be friends, since we're both gamers. The name is Takakuma. I make a living from gaming, more or less. Ever heard of me? Huh? Takakuma? The pro gamer? Yeah, you're the guy from all those videos online! And you're the one they call the king, right? I've always wanted to play you. But I don't know if it's a good idea. I mean, if I beat you, your rank will definitely drop. And I don't need people bashing me for bullying a kid. You bastard! You called me weak! That's it! We're playing! I won't lose! As I expected of the king. Alright, let's get this started. Alright! I'm gonna win! I have to! No way! Oh! The king is getting destroyed! That's Takakuma, isn't it? He's awesome! I missed? The king lost! That doesn't count! Let's play again! You got it. Wow, that's ten losses in a row! The king got slaughtered! <laughs> that's hilarious. One more! One more game! No matter how many times we play, the end result will be the same. We should probably stop. For your sake. Shut up! You bastard! You cheated, didn't you? 
Yeah, you tell him. Right? There's no way I could have lost. Man, I guess the king is just a little kid after all. Looks like I overestimated your ability. I'd feel bad beating you again, so I'm going to go. Make sure you practice for the next time we play. Damn it! You gotta be kidding me! Get your revenge. I will! I'm the one who's gonna win in the end. If I lose, it's all over for me. I'm gonna beat him next time for sure. This isn't over. The strongest always wins in the end. Just like the Phantom Thieves. Watch! I'll win for sure next time! I'm not a loser! You'll see! This genius is even more motivated than ever before. I didn't think you were a loser. You're you're a kid. You're like ten. <laughs> oh well, it's okay. Uh, we ranked up with Shinya. Woo! All right. Your tower confidant has increased to rank four. You will now earn more EXP from Arcana, or increasing percentage of the tower Arcana. Crap! It's late. I gotta go. What? Man, that Takakuma though, telling me to practice for next time. A grown up shouldn't spend so much time playing video games. Interacting with Shinya has made my heart grow. I feel like my kindness has increased. Daggy, don't call me out like that. Bye. Did they tire me out? I'll see you later. Was Shido san actually a bad guy? Hmm. I don't know anymore. I told you, you can't just phantom thieves! What's Akechikun saying? If the country's in trouble, then shido sans should be fine. Ah, you're back. Well, it certainly sounds like people trusted Shido. Yikes. Um, okay. So, Chihaya won't be available tonight because it's raining, but that should be okay. We shouldn't need to rank up with Shinya any more points because we should rank up with him next time. Who else is available though? No one. No one is available. Great. Wonderful. I'm gonna go get my guts up. Oh, frick. Chihaya is not available. Ah. Uh, I wanted to... I wanted to get the, the, the reading to get my... so I'd get more guts points, but because Chihaya is not available, I won't get them. Okay, that's fine. That's, that's bearable. I'm gonna go upstairs and play a video game. Alright, it's my best option at this point, so... Let's do it! Oh, So what are you gonna do? Let's play a game, Mona. Um, because I have power intuition. Let's play it. Okay, let's start a power intuition. Well, then. By the way, haven't you read that secret technique book? The amount of time you have for the input commands will increase, making the game easier, right? Let's use the technique. <laughs> Makes sense as you learn how to. Alright, let's do this. Hmm. So your first opponent is a Kung Fu Master. His attacks are apparently pretty ruthless. You're running low on health. You could probably win if you land a special move. Oh! Hey, the enemy's son! Go for the special! Okay, okay, use the arrow keys to match the arrows on screen within the time limit and press X to punch. Okay, okay, this is why I need the time. Um, because you need to actually, like, do it as a... a quick string. Uh, okay. Ah, there we go. That took me a bit. <laughs> oh! Alright, it's over! You won! Okay. Wow, you bet the level! You're amazing! It was incredible watching you go up against such a tough opponent. Hmm. <sighs> I don't know if we're gonna get the guts. I'm kind of worried that we won't. Nice. This is probably a good stopping point. Let's end here for today. I'm so worried. Will we get our confidants done? Ooh. Well, either way, hi there. It's, it's, it's time to have a day. Haru's finding it hard to stay calm. Does that mean- Oh, she's not available! 
Uh, she probably wants to go with Mentos. No one else is available. Uh, Kasumi is available. She's maxed though. Um, although their names are yellow if they're maxed, but hers isn't. Does that mean there's something new with her, or? Hmm. Um. So I could go to Mementos, or I could try and just get my guts up. And I think I'm gonna try and get my guts up because I don't want to go to Mementos right now. So I'm gonna go to Shinjuku, and I'm gonna have Chihaya read my fortune. And I'm gonna try and get my guts up. Um. Somehow. Wait. 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 Okay. I thought that the door was gone. Oh my goodness! I'm having a time. Hello, Chihaya. Er, uh, please read my fortune. I need some guts. What shall we do? Er, uh, so that would be luck reading. Um, half fortune read. Um... Now. It's Sunday as well, actually. Okay, I want to increase my guts. Er, uh, we've done this before, so I'm not reading this all. Because it's Sunday as well, I think I can do another thing. Um... What do you think? So, okay, hold on. Um, I'm trying to think of things I can do that aren't time consuming that might get me guts. And in the underground walkway, there is a smoothie stall. Um, the drinks here do stat ups, but I've never drank them before, so I don't think it'll be the one that I want today. Wow. Um, oh, I've never read this? I've never read this! Oh, I'm sorry, I just I tapped through that entire thing, I'm sorry. I think I have a special juice, basically. It's called Aujuru. Hey. I'm sorry. Oh, this one's charm. Hey. I don't need it. Dang it. Well, I'm gonna ignore that then. I, I don't need it anyway. Err. Uh, in which case... I'm gonna go back home and play Power Intuition again, I think. Oh wait, no, I can't because I left. Wait, can I? Oh, I can. Can I? Hmm. Um, oh no, let's go somewhere else. Oh, dang it. I can't do that to get my guts up. Oh, hi Kataba, I love you. Um... Oh crap, what can I do to get my guts up? Um Uh Status? Billiards? That won't get me guts though. Um Oh, I can't do anything for guts. Oh frick! I can't do anything for guts. I might have to go with mementos. Um I think the stat up should last all day though, so. I, I want to go and talk to Kasumi for half a second though. I why is her name white? That's my real question here. Um. Oh my God! Look at how cute she is. Oh, her outfit. Oh, I love it. Oh, hi Kasumi. Your outfit is super cute. Senpai. Oh, Senpai. You seem kind of tired. Are you okay? It's important to give it your best, but please don't push yourself too hard. Um, would you like to go hang out someplace today? It's good to take breaks now and then, so if you don't mind... I have a solid bond with Kasumi. Um, my bond with her's already maxed. I feel like dancing! Oh, I miss you, Kasumi. I'm sorry, I'm not gonna hang out with you. Maybe some other time. Oh, is that so? Then perhaps next time. Sorry, Kasumi, I love you. Uh, yeah, no, I, I don't know anything I could do for guts. Um... Yeah, I, I genuinely can't think of anything I could do for guts. Um, not during the daytime anyway, because it all seems to be nighttime stuff. I can't go to the the. Mm, I can't do most of these things until until nighttime. Um, I guess we're just gonna go to Mementos. Yeah. I might end up having to go to Mementos twice then. Oh, I don't really want to go to Mementos. You know what? I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go to Mementos today. Um. Ah, uh, what else can I do for guts? I don't have a, I don't have a book. I, where would I be able to read it anyway? Because I can't go to school and read it, and I can't read it in the blog. The diner? No, that's for studying though. Um. Oh well, you can get a guts thing for studying at the diner. It's not very much. Um. But now that I've left the blog, um, I can't do much else. Uh. I think at the maid cafe you could get a bit of guts, but it's not very much I don't think, but it won't be very much if I go to the diner either because that's more for knowledge. 
Uh, Big Bang Burger stuff it. I'm going there. You get guts from doing a Big Bang Burger. I'm gonna just go and eat a burger and be sad because I can't think of anything else to do. Er, uh, hi there. I'm taking the challenge. Yeah. I'm not reading this. Let's do some... Yeah, sure. We're doing this. Uh, this is fine. Thank you very much. Hi there. We're wow. Yes, congratulations. A burger. Uh, now then. Okay, this is fine. I'm sorry. I'm not reading any of that. The way you eat is so impressive. I would have expected nothing less of a captain. As I've explained before, there are no further ranks for you to achieve. However, to commemorate your further challenge success, we present to you our world famous Big Bang Burger. We got 10 Big Bang Burgers. Please come again. Now then, I look forward to your valiant return. I knew you could do it. Man, you really know how to, you really know how to eat though. It's like you don't know the meaning of the word fear. <laughs> okay, okay, we got three points. Oh, come on! Wanna head back? Well, why don't we head home? I'm all hungry now. <sighs> One of these days. I'll actually get some guts. That day's not today. Ah, you're back. Hi, Sojuro. I'm not really sure why, but I feel restless for some reason. We managed to steal Shido's heart, but reactions have been less than ideal. Yes, it has been quite difficult to relax. I wonder if people will be disappointed to find out how his, what his true nature really is. It might just be more than plain old disappointment. Either way, it's better than just let him keep deceiving people. But even if his true nature becomes widely known, I wonder what results this election will bring. I guess we'll see. There aren't really many great politicians running, but anyone would be better than Shido. Anyways, let's wait for him to have the change of heart. We could talk more after that. Yeah, no point in worrying too much about it right now. Um, okay, okay, Chihaya wants to chat. So we'll probably hang out with Chihaya. Sorry, Lala Chan, I'm, I'm not working. Uh, first of all, let's watch TV. We're only halfway through election season, but it seems the victory is already clear. The United Future, led by Mr. Shido, have been dominating other parties. Victory seems certain for them. The people have high hopes about having a new prime minister. Mr. Shido has not made any public appearances recently, perhaps due to how hard he worked until now. <sighs> I can not stand it if he still won after we went through all that trouble to change his heart. Yeah, it would really suck if he won. Um, not that we could do much about it. Okay, Chihai is available. I feel like Oya's not been available for a while. Is she okay? Um, anyway, let's let's read this text and go tie it with Chihai. There is something I need to tell you. All right, I want to talk to you face to face. Are you free tonight? All right, let's go hang out with Chihai. Let's do it. I'll come talk. Okay, I'll be waiting for you. Is. Recently, my reputation has really started shooting up. A lot of my clients leave happy now, too. I even managed to use my own powers to alter some fates that what seemed inevitable. I suppose all you really need to change fate is a strong will, like what you have. I wish I could do more, though. Are you on break right now, Mifune-kun? What? F fukurai san So are you the apprentice I've heard so much about. I've been wondering, why are you so interested in Mifune-kun? I like fortune-telling. Uh, that's why you volunteered to apprentice under her. You must be quite a big fan. That aside, I have to commend your judgment in choosing Mifune-kun. Her fortunes are like a light, guiding lost lambs through the unending darkness ahead. Oh, um... By the way, Amamiya-san, uh, this... By the way, Amamiya-san, uh, this man here is Fukurai-san. He's, um, the chairman of the ADP. Oh, right, you don't know what about the ADP yet. It stands for... Assembly of Divine Power. Her goal is to relieve the hearts and minds of today's weary souls via healing events and seminars. We also sell holy stones, the well from which our divine power springs. They are a large part of our business. Um, oh, Fukurai-san, um... That reminds me. Yokoda-kun was telling me you've been acting a little strange recently. 
More importantly, it seems you've started falling behind on your holy stone sales quotas. Is everything okay? But yes, I'll cover the decrease in revenue with my fortune telling fees. Um, fukurai -san. I, um, I'm not sure how effective these holy stones really are. Excuse me. Uh, well... But do you remember who showed you the way when you arrived here from the countryside, lost and confused? Do you remember who saved you when you were stuck working at a seedy club with no tur place to turn? It was me. Are you saying you no longer have trust in someone who's done so much for you? But that's not it. Then enough of this skepticism. Just focus on continuing your role as the Maiden of Relief. Read the fortunes of those unfortunate souls who come to us, and lead them to salvation with the Holy Stones. Maiden of Relief? Uh, that's a nickname I gave her over at the ADP. Beautiful, don't you think? Hmm, I... The, you don't want things to go back to how they were, do you, Mifuniku? Don't you remember breaking down in front of me, telling me how everyone called you a monster? If you don't carry your weight as the Maiden of Relief, you'll be exactly that. A monster. Leave her alone. I'm a mia -san. Fine. If you want to spend your time fooling around with this child, go right ahead. But don't forget me, Funikun. The ADP is the only place you will ever belong. <laughs> I I've never actually worked in a nightclub. I did get tricked into walking into one, though. Anyway, the chairman is known for exaggerating details. Uh, you must think I'm weird, huh? All this talk about me being a maiden or a monster. You're just Chihaya to me. What? Huh? Nobody's ever treated me so nicely before. But, by the way, it was pretty amazing how we stood up to the chairman back there. I would never have been able to talk to him about the Holy Stones had I been alone. But your strength helped me to speak up. I need to be strong like you more often. I guess that's a strong resolve from Chihaya. Alright, we ranked up with Chihaya. I got rank 6 of the Fortune Arcana. All right. Your Wheel of Fortune Commandant has increased to rank 6. You will now earn more XP from Arcana by some freezing personas of the Wheel of Fortune Arcana. Um, even so, the chairman seems serious about the whole Holy Stone issue. He'll make me pay a fine if I don't meet my quotas, and there's a huge penalty from resigning from my post. I suppose my fate is impossible to change after all. Um, anyway, I should close up for today. Until next time. Good night. Uh, um, I'm sorry about today. I already know what I must do in order to change my fate. But whenever I face the chairman, I just can't find the courage to say what I need to. We'll work on it together. Hearing that makes me happy, but I feel like it's not good for me. I don't want to have to keep relying on you. I'm going to think about all this a little more. Thank you once again for today. I'll see you next time. Dang it. <sighs> I picked the wrong one! I knew it was the wrong one! No, no! The special of the Phantom Thieves is that it was cancelled. I heard Akechikun would be on it too. I heard it was to avoid causing confusion about the election. They should ignore pranks like they should ignore pranks like that. They said all those awful things to make Shido-san look bad, but it makes me want to support him more. The more skilled you are, the more enemies you have. I want to see him absolve those rumors for good. Damn it! I can't believe they're saying some crap like that. It's like they're brainwashed or something. What I think about how he used us. Damn it! It still pisses me right the hell off! Well, it'll be fine. Soon he'll spill his guts. Then everyone will know we're right. 
Just wait and see. I'm just gonna grit my teeth until then. Only thing, to, only thing left to do is wait for the outcome. Hey, hey, should you tell the others about that target of mementos? Maybe not today, Mona, because Haru wants to talk. Meeting yesterday? It wasn't yesterday. Anyway, um, I think we're hanging out with Haru today. No one else is available. Um, yeah, so that was fun with Chihaya. I feel really bad for her. She's in a situation where I think she's being blackmailed or... Um, Something similar to that. Let's let's watch TV. You made the right decision to confess. Now your trial should take your extenuating circumstances into account. But why did you suddenly decide to tell me? It's because I wanted to eat Katsudon. For real? Come on, that's why? Oh, hey, did they give you Katsudon in jail to eat while you were there? No. <laughs> they they kicked him and they hurt him. Oh god, hi Sojiro. Mm -hmm. You gotta sit back and watch for a while. Then why don't you study? Don't blame me if you cry at the exams. Um but Sojiro, I'm dead. I'm not I'm not going to exams, I'm dead. Mm -hmm. Hi hi hello, how are you two doing? Didn't the Phantom Thieves die? I thought we were safe from them now. And then there's that calling card. Shido san denied any of it was true though. I wonder if Shido san is okay. I'm worried with the election so close. <sighs> I don't know what to believe. It's all too much for an old timer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think the longer you're in a mindset, the more difficult it is to change that mindset, and that might be true of those who have thought Shido was good for a long time. Hmm. Anyway, hi Chihaya. Um, um I'm gonna get a, an affinity reading for Chihaya because I'm what not gonna do? rank up with her. <laughs> so I'm just gonna go ahead and just um, spend some money on her. Err, uh, yeah, this is fine. <laughs> we have so much money, it's fine. It's fine. It's totally fine. Here we go. Err, uh, also we have read this before, so I'm not reading it again. Oh good, my feelings reached the other person. Oh dang it, I'm still not gonna level up with her though. Think? Uh, she hi uh. Okay, it's fine. She probably will be available next time anyway, so it's fine. Um, oh, actually, my vegetables should be ready though. I should go and chat with her to get the vegetables first. Um, and then I can get to rank ten with her. Hey. <laughs> okay, let's go and talk to Haru. Haru, hi. How you doing? First of all, I'll look at my text from her. Yesterday, I had a big meeting with the company, and I have some things I'd like to say about that. Do you have spare time today? I know this is a difficult period for you, but I want to tell you about it. Oh, Haru, you're so good. Okay, um, I'm gonna hang out with her, but first of all, hello, Haru, how you doing? Hey! Er, uh, hi there, vegetables. <laughs> that makes me happy. These ones have done enough growing, so we can harvest them now. There we go. <laughs> They've grown so well. They're all so healthy. Treat them with care and respect, okay? Alright, I got three moonlight carrots. And I'm gonna ask for some more moonlight carrots, because I'm trash. Hey. Hi there, I'm here for more vegetables. <laughs> These vegetables should grow nicely here. Okay, let's get some more moonlight carrots. To be careful not to damage the roots. I hope this grows up healthy. The moonlight carrot is doing well. It should be ready to harvest on the 8th. <laughs> I hope you're looking forward to it. Thank you, Haru. I love you. Let's hang out. Hey. Err, uh, I came to see you. Thank you. Why, oh, thank you. So I went over to the company the other day and I have some news. Are you free to speak today? I feel like I could be close to Haru face the Empress person of Queen's necklace. I feel like my bond with Haru will go stronger soon. Nobody thinks you're alive. What are you gonna do? Let's hang out with Haru. Thank you. I'd like to drink a nice cup of Boss's coffee. Could we head to Leblanc? My, this has.
has such profoundly bold flavor. I heard you've been getting into the roasting scene, little lady. Yes, I often have the urge to drink a fresh cup of your coffee. <laughs> that near brings a tear to my eye. Well, I'm heading home now. Close up shop for me, will you? I was finally able to convey my feelings during the company meeting. Not just about the new chain, but about the future of the company. And even about father. I think my presence angered some people at first. But in the end, they all listened to my thoughts. You've done great, Haru. All that nervousness was exhausting. I've had diplomatic dealings with VIPs before. But I've never once spoken my true feelings. That aside, after talking with management, I've decided to let them handle Okumura Foods. It's simply not something I would have been able to supervise on my own. And after their sincere acceptance of the public's criticism, I felt it was okay to trust them. As for my future goals, I'm interested in opening a small private cafe. Everything will be homegrown. From the coffee to the salad, I want to set my own standards. It'll be a shop that people love, like grandfathers. And like this place. What do you think? I'm sure you'll succeed. It's a pretty boring dream, huh? But when you say that, I feel like it will actually happen. Truth be told, I don't plan on opening the shop immediately after I graduate. I'll need to study and improve my knowledge beforehand. After all, right now it's only a hobby. Perhaps I should apprentice here at Leblon in the meantime. It's hard work, you know. <laughs> I take it that sentiment comes from personal experience? Either way, I think this dream of mine will be no easy feat. But I somehow managed to tackle my childhood dream of becoming a heroine of justice. If I act with resolve and believe in my actions, I know I'll be able to achieve anything. I'm so glad I met you. At first, it was nice having someone that understands me. But now, it's much more. There may be times where people resent me for it. But as long as you're here, I'll be okay. You know, I'd like to return the favor. If you ever find yourself in trouble, I'll be there for you. Feel free to rely on me from now on. I have the strength to help you. I can sense it. I feel a strong bond with her. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened the ultimate secret of the Empress, granting thee infinite power. Alright, we have reached ra rank 10, max rank, with Haru, the Empress. And we got Second Awakening, transforms Persona into a mythological trickster. All right. Your Empress Confidant has increased to max rank. You will now earn more EXP from Arcana Burst with busy Personas of the Empress Arcana. You can All now right. use Mother Harlot, the most powerful Persona of the Empress Arcana. Haru's persona Milady, Milady has transformed into Astarte. When I open my cafe, I'll let you be my first customer. I look forward to that. <laughs> I can't wait! My, look at the time! We've been speaking for quite a while. I should be going now. 
Take care. I walked hard to the station. All right, this is Astarte. Uh, she got a vain nuke, which is so good. Oh my god, it's a miracle we did not get hit by a nuke attack during the fight against Shido, dear god. Um, oh god, what do I want to get rid of? Um, well, goodbye, Cyboost. It's fine. Ah, you're back. Aren't you bored? Wait, aren't you bored? I've got some time today, if you want me to show you the ropes. Oh! Well, I mean, thank you for letting me know that you'd like me to hang out with you. I would very much like to hang out with you, especially since no one else is available. <laughs> um, I'll hang out with Sojuro in just a second, but first of all, let's talk about Haru. I love Haru. Haru is so good. Her Commandant ranks, her Commandant link is so good. Like, it's genuinely one of the better Commandant links in my opinion, because just the story and everything feels very cohesive, and it makes a lot of sense. With, with everything that Haru goes through, it makes sense that she would have, have issues in trusting people. You know, we don't know her for very long, but from the moment we see her, she's already... You know, she can't trust her father. She's not sure she can even trust the Phantom Thief. She can trust Mona, sure, because Mona helped her. But everyone else, she's not sure about. Um, and she manages to grow and overcome her issues and manages to find a way to trust in others again. And she's just so strong. It's so good. And... Again, much like all the other Commandant links, it marvellously closes her story from the main game. Um, I I love Haru's Confidant. Um, it's just a real shame that she joins the party so late into the game. Because I feel like if you don't do her Confidant, you're missing out on a lot of really interesting information about her. Because I barely got any of her Confidant done the first time I played the game. And Haru is one of my favourite party members. I love her. I think her story is fantastic. But I didn't get to see that in my first playthrough. And it was a real shame. <laughs> anyway, I love her. She's great. Uh, I'll stop gushing about Haru now. Let's, let's hang out with Sojuro. Um, I shouldn't be able to... I've already had a fortune reading today, so I can't ask Chihai for another one. I'm just gonna go straight ahead and hang out with Sojuro. Let's do this. Do you have any plans tonight? Hang out with me for a bit, will you? I feel like I could become close to she I feel like I could become close to Sojuro thanks to the higher fan persona Mishiguchi. I feel like my bond with Sojuro will go stronger soon. Nobody thinks you're alive at this point, so you should be fine. What are you gonna do? Well we should get to rank ten. <laughs> Hell yeah, let's do it. Alright, let's hang out with them. I'm going to the church with Futaba. Sorry, but you're coming along too. Why are you going there? We're going to visit Wakaba's grave. All right then. Be ready in three minutes. I always think about Wakaba on the anniversary of her death, but it's been a while since I visited. I've been so busy with the shop and all. No, no, that's not it. The guilt is what kept me from coming. I thought Wakaba would be angry with me. But now that I managed to get Futaba over here, I can finally meet her with my head held high. <laughs> I sure kept her waiting. But it felt good to tell her about how much Futaba's improved lately. Oh, I told her about you, too. Thank you. Idiot. I should be the one thanking you. <laughs> this is the first time the four of us are all together. Sojiro, what are you smirking for? Uh, this is what my real smile looks like. I approve. Whew. Oh, I have some news. The family court gave me a call the other day. Futaba's uncle decided to retract his report. It was because of you, wasn't it? I wonder if the day will come that she goes out to be someone's bride. I'm sure she'll make a fine lady either way. After all, she is Wakaba's daughter. Oh, do all fathers have to go through this anxiety? You know, I really just wanted to have you help out at the store. You showed me so much more. 
You showed me I have a family I need to protect. Not just Futaba, but you, too. I may not always be reliable, but feel free to come to me if anything happens. I'll be there for you, as family. And, ah, uh, uh, I know. I'll teach you everything I can. You're a full-fledged man now. That might not be enough to return the favor, but it's all I can do. I feel a strong bond with Sojiro. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the Hierophant, granting thee infinite power. Alright, we have reached max rank with Sojiro, and we have learned Curry Mastery. It allows you to make curry that greatly restores SP of all allies. Why did they give us a medium one? I'm so confused. <laughs> All right. Your Hierophant Confidant has increased to max rank. You'll now earn more EXP from Arcana versus Crazy Personas of the Hierophant Arcana. You have learned Curry Mastery from Sojiro. All and right. you can now fuse Koryu, the most powerful persona of the Hierophant Arcana. Oh, and uh, could you not, uh, you know, get with Futaba? I can't imagine you calling me father. Although, maybe it wouldn't be so bad. What are you two talking about? Nothing. I hunger. Curry time! Yeah, yeah. Let's go home. This campaign season is really heating up. Are they going to allow this election to continue? They have to. We can't just not have a prime minister. I'm fine with Messiah Shishido. Not like we have many other options. Yeah, I guess I'll vote for Shido-san too. You think Shido's gonna become prime minister at this rate? With Akechi Kun and Shido san, it feels like some heroes have been born this year. Well, shall we begin? That's right. The turning point of any era is when a hero is born. They address everyone's fears and worries and skillfully carry out a revolution. Representative Shido is like that, don't you think? A hero? Him? Don't make me laugh. This is getting really bad. We need to make everyone realize it. Only thing left to do is wait for the outcome. Hey! You better not have forgotten about the persona you left here! Listen carefully, you must come today, otherwise you shall very well lose that persona. Crap, I gotta save our sen. Oh, our theme set updated! Okay, hi. Let's chat. Sojiro, huh? Holy frick. I love his confidant so much. I really do. Again, one of my favorite confidants. It's so good. Oh, he's just like thinking back to the start of the game when he just was so gruff towards us and didn't seem to care at all. I was like, get upstairs, stay on my side. I don't care, you're a criminal. And now he's like, you're part of the family. Oh, my heart. Oh, it's just such a good confidant, right? Good confidant, like, um, and I just, I especially love it because it really ties into Futaba's story, and obviously, I really love Futaba's story. Um, all of the information about Wakaba as well. Oh, just all of it. Oh, I love it so much. It's just really nice that we get to see both sides of a story about a family coming back together, basically, or coming together, I guess. Oh, I just really enjoy it. I really enjoy Sojiro's confidants. They're seriously my favorite. Like my first run of the game, I think I maxed out Sojiro, Futaba, and Mishima. 
and I think that's the only three confidants I maxed out. And you know what? I picked some- I picked two good ones. I picked Sojo and Futaba. Mishima, like, he just ranks up anyway, so he was gonna happen anyway. But no, I maxed out my kindness for them. <laughs> um, yeah, I didn't do very well my first playthrough. <laughs> Yikes. Anyway! Uh, today I guess we're gonna go and hang out with Shinya since he's the only one available in the daytime now at all, actually, because everyone else is maxed. Uh, like, all of our friends are technically available, but Shinya's the only one who we even need to hang out with. Uh, I will head over to Sichihaya first to try and get her some points, but before I do that, let's watch TV. Silver to nine one. Your hand was shaking as you moved that piece. Oh, was that it? Oh, was it? I probably have no choice but to give up at this point. None of my opponents have ever trembled while playing me, so I'm actually sort of jealous now. Ah, uh, fair. Hi there. Hmm? Oh, that's the same thing. I'm not studying, sorry. I don't go to school anymore, Sojiro. God. Okay. <laughs> let's go to the red light district. <laughs> Okay, Chihaya! Chihaya! Hello! Give me an affinity reading and then I need to go and save our set from jail afterwards. Uh, get a fortune reading. What Hi there! Um, I want to be closer to my friends. Uh, and my friends is you. I want to be closer to you. 5,000 yen. Hell yeah. Here we go. Okay. But yeah, I'll do this, then I'll go save our set and then we'll go and hang out with Shinya. Okay, Felix have reached the other person. Oh, we can do for friendship. Good, good, good. What she wasn't think? even available in the interim, so that's okay. Okay, let's go and hang out with the twins for half a second while I go and hey, save our send. Boop. There we go. <laughs> Alrighty, we are back in jail. Um, do I need to... Register. Justine, you want to register it? Yes, do I do. Like to register this? All right, there we go. Uh, and then I'm gonna go to train for snow. Time for finished for now. I'll train. Take care of them. There we go. I need to reclaim Marsen. You want to release it? Yeah. Looks a little stronger. Okay, you he's a little stronger, so that's good. Resist ice. That's very good, right? Increases resistance to ice attacks, nullifies weakness. Well then, resist ice. There we go. Um, with him out of there, I might quickly strengthen him sacrifice. using my queen's necklace because I no longer need that for Haru. Hmm. Oh, that will do. Or how's how's Mishiguchi actually? Hmm. That will do. Okay, okay. He doesn't get the times three thing. What are you waiting for? Um, but it's a lot more exp. Ha. Huh. Yeah, I'm gonna use Mishiguchi then. Mm. That will do. Yeah, let's do this it. This is what the person. <laughs> this may be a bit gruesome. I mean, it's not even the EXP I'm doing it for, really. It's the stats, but. All right, we've got a stronger Arsen now. Hooray! And I'm gonna put him back in jail. <laughs> All right. Okay, what do you get? What do you get? Okay, okay, okay. His okay, okay. so is 50 now. Wow, he might actually survive. Like if I was, yeah. Oh, okay. Inherit cyanide. Ooh. Oh wait, didn't he have cyanide before, and I had to get rid of it? I think he did. Um, cyanide is better than Agilao or Magarula. Agilao, sorry, I said that weirdly. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of Magal Magarula. I think actually. Yeah, that's fine with me. All right, and then I will quickly go and put him back in jail. Our right, train, our send. So, I'll give him gonna light some in which incense are you gonna light? One of these ones. Uh strike the endurance? Yeah, why not? I'll put this incense in there with them. Yeah, do Get it. Over here. And now he's in jail again. Alright, he should be fine now. Finished? I hope. Alright, let's leave. No slacking off. I'm gonna go and hang out with Shania. And then we'll probably have to stop, but you know, it's fine. Alright, let's read this text from Shania. I can train you if you're free today. In exchange, I want to talk to you about something. Is that okay? Uh, yeah, it's okay. Let's do it. I'll be right there. I'm glad. I want to tell you all about Takakuma. Okay, I'll be waiting at the arcade. Hey! I can't stop thinking about my battle with Takakuma. 
I mean, I couldn't do anything to him. There's just no way. He must have raped him. Right? He must have done something to win. I've heard rumors about Takakuma. People say he uses cheat armor. You know what that is, right? He totally broke the rules by equipping it. By equipping it. I bet that's why my usual shots didn't work against him. That has to be the reason. But next time we play, definitely. All right. I'm definitely gonna demolish him. I'm sure you can do it. Yep. Even the Phantom Thieves had a comeback victory against Medjed. I'm gonna win next time. Just watch. Hey. The thing is, I told my mom about what happened with Takakuma. But... She didn't really care. All she said was, okay. She was probably because I lost. She doesn't like kids who lose. My mom was told me that we need to be strong. Because it's just the two of us. She said no one helps the weak. They just get preyed on. That's why I want to get stronger. Strong enough that we won't get preyed on. Strong enough that we'd be the predators. That's exactly who the Phantom Thieves are. The strongest. Who can prey on anyone. Once I become the strongest, my mom will be able to count on me. The only way I can win is through games. That's why I can't lose. What should I do about Takakuma's armor? The strategy I used last time didn't work. You need a new strategy. Of course! I'm definitely gonna win next time! Thanks. You're kinda like a big brother to me. I could talk to you about anything. I heard that's what it's like to have a sibling. I feel Shinya's brotherly affection. Dang, this kid is really sweet. He's also, like, kinda troubled, and I'm a bit worried about him. But at the same time, he, he feels like we're a brother to him, that's cute. And we also got rank 5 with Shinya, and we got laced bullets. Increases the success rate of an ailment inflicting gunshot. I don't think I actually have an ailment inflicting gun right now, but that's quite cool. All right. Your tower confidant has increased to rank 5. You will now earn more XP from Arcana, but some your personas of the tower Arcana. Shinya taught you how to use laced bullets. Takakuma better watch out. Ah. Crap, look at the time! I gotta go. Interacting with Shinya has made my heart grow. I feel like my kindness has increased. Alright, nice. We got points that we didn't need. <laughs> Later. Yeah. Oh, Amamiya-san, I, uh, appreciate your input on that issue today. <laughs> I sound like a grown-up, huh? Yeah, my mom says that a lot on her conference calls. That Takakuma. Even thinking about it pisses me off. I'll beat him next time for sure. But since he might be cheating, normal training isn't gonna cut it. I gotta think of a new strategy by the time I, by the next time I challenge him. You're a sharp kid. Nah, if I'm trying to be the best, then I should be able to figure this out no problem. I feel like I'm right on the edge of a good idea, though. Once I figure everything out, you should come train with me. I gotta be the best, or else my mom won't. Well, I'll definitely win next time. See ya! Well, it's fine. We'll rank up with them. It's fine. Ah, you're back. I really do worry. <laughs> The election battle has reached the halfway point. The polls for each election board have remained the same, though. Does this mean Shido's victory is guaranteed? That would be the case. I wonder if voting will shift if Shido has a change of heart. Nobody will vote for him once they find out he's a criminal. Assuming they find out before they vote. That's the important part. We would prefer him to announce his crimes before the election. 
But if the change of heart doesn't make it, the election will just go as expected. We have to believe. Yeah, I'm sure it'll happen beforehand. All we can do is change his heart. He won't be able to put a stop to this if we succeed. We should be able to put a stop to this if we succeed. Well, hopefully we do succeed. I see the soldier was available, but like, we just maxed him, so we're not gonna hang out with him. In fact, we can only hang out with Chihaya. Which is unsurprising. I think we have enough time to very quickly hang out with her. So let's just go ahead and answer this text from her, shall we? Do you remember what I told you last time? It's about that man who visited the other day. That was Chairman Fukurai. Well, I'd like to talk to you about him. Are you free today? Let's do it. Let's hang out with Chihaya. I'll be right there. Uh, great! We could talk after I close up shop. Stop by then. Um, so I've been thinking a lot about our last meeting, and I wasn't completely honest with you. But I've decided I'm going to tell you everything about Fukurai-san. Well, as well as the real reason why I decided to leave my village. I... I already told you about how it was a small traditional town tucked away in the mountains, right? Well, when I was young, I predicted a major earthquake. The villagers revered me as a messenger of God. But when I, was kept, but when I kept predicting disasters, they started blaming me for everything. They said I was cursed, a monster. And so I locked myself away. People would still come by to throw stones through the windows, though. Mm. Things went on like that for some time. Until one day, an angry mob came and burned the house down. That's why I decided to come to Tokyo after graduating high school. I wanted to change my fate. I didn't know anyone, but I needed money. So I took the first job I could find at a small nightclub. I found myself surrounded by dangerous people. But that's when Fukurai-san approached me. Um, he's a psychic too, you know. He knew from a mere glance that I was a runaway who had just come to Tokyo. Then, once I told him why I decided to leave my village, he immediately invited me to join up with him, with the ADP. That's when he gave me the moniker, the Maiden of Relief. He told me I possessed a divine power to save others from misfortune. That I could become more than the monster people saw me as. I broke down the moment he said that. <laughs> Hmm. Deep down, I knew all along that the Holy Stones didn't have any powers. But I thought I might be able to save people, even though I was a monster. Or perhaps because I was a monster. Uh. So the truth is, I was only ever selling I was only ever selling those holy stones for my own personal benefit. I'm a terrible person, huh? I don't think so. What? My fortune said you're supposed to hate me. I never thought you would overturn even that fate, Amamiya san. I've made up my mind. You know what? I see now how wrong I was. I'm not going to keep turning a blind eye to injustice. I'm going to expose the chairman's fraudulent activities and wake up the other members to the truth. Thank you very much. Thank you so much for listening to me today. If there's anything ever you need to talk about, I'd be glad to return the favor, Amamiya-san. I can sense a strong resolve from Shihaya. Alright, we have reached rank 7 with uh, the fortune teller. And we got a special fate reading. Provides a preview of all abilities for a confidant of your choice. This is the most useless confidant ability in the game. Because Google exists. And besides that, it just feels useless. I don't know. Anyway, we got that. All right. Your Wheel of Fortune confidant has increased to rank 7. You will now earn more XP from Arcana Burst and Fusing Personas of the Wheel of Fortune Arcana. Chihaya is now able to tell you your special fate reading. Special fate reading. By getting your fate round, you can find out a confidant's future abilities. They will then be viewable from the confidant menu. Now that I think about it, though, just saying the Holy Stones are powerless won't convince people. The ADP holds what they call seminars for believers, but it's really just brainwashing. 
That's why everyone thinks they'll be unhappy without a holy stone. Honestly, I don't hold any sway there, even though I'm the Maiden of Relief. Um... Just who is the chairman? Let me think it over some more. We can talk further next time. Thank you. Well, thank you again for today. Alamiya-san, please hear me out. Now that I think about it, I barely knew anything about the chairman, nor the ADP in general. So I'm thinking of doing some research on the ADP first. I'm done turning a blind eye. Are you gonna be okay? Are you worried about me? <laughs> that makes me kind of happy. But yes, I'll be alright. As long as I have the trust of my clients and believers. I am the maiden of relief after all. From now on, I will see with my own two eyes rather than through cryptic fortunes. Please, I'll, I'll let you know if I find anything, so please promise me you'll come by again. Now, I should be going. All right, and we are straight to the next day. Um, this is where we're gonna have to end off the episode, unfortunately, because we've been going for a little while. Uh, that being said, I will get rid of this this text real quick. Um, Now's our chance. So now we need to figure out what we're actually doing um, next time. I don't think Sheen is available. He's not available. What I might end up doing then is try to get my guts up again, um, because <laughs> dear God, we're having trouble with that. Um, and our confidants are doing okay. We have how many days left? Sorry, we have 11 days. 11 days, okay. Hmm. And how many ranks do we have left? Okay, we've got three with the fortune teller, three with EY, three with Oya, so that's nine. And they're, they're all at night, so that's nine nights that we need to worry about. So I've got two extra nights. We should be okay. And then five days. I think we should get it all done. It might be a bit of a squeeze. It all depends on when they're available as well, so... If they're not available, then we can't do things for them. But the hope is that they will be available. I'm also going to very quickly check how close I am to maxing my guts. Um, just because I'm a little worried. Uh, but then we'll, hey. then we'll stop, because um, it's, it's getting late. <laughs> Uh, I will very quickly just check this though. How much guts do I need? Definitely close to improving. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, we're gonna stop here for today. So hi, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please feel free to let me know down below what you thought of everything that happened in this episode here today, including hanging out with our confidants, which is pretty much all we did, as well as maxing out both Haru and Sojiro. I hope you enjoyed that. I really did. Um, next time we'll continue trying to back all of our confidants, I guess. We might end up going to Mementos, to be honest. Um, I've still look quite decided. Um, yeah, it'll be fine. I don't know. Um, but yeah, we'll decide what we're doing next time. For now, though, thank you so much again for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I hope you have a great day, night, or whatever the time is for you. And I will see you next time. A grown-up shouldn't spend so much time playing video games! Okay, listen.